found. Well, the truth is, my dad found it and he texted me about it. And it's these little pizzas. Not like this other keto pizza I tried before from Quest. That's a full size, well, guess. That's like a medium or whatever. And that's like a really small. And that one's crust is made out of cheese and milk protein isolate. This one's crust is made out of chicken and cheese. So even lower carbs. And it's eight carbs total if I eat the whole thing. And this one's 12 carbs total if I eat the whole thing. They're both, you know, fairly good numbers. But this is even better. If you turn this over, if I eat this whole thing, I get 560 calories. Focus! I said focus! So if I eat this whole thing, I get 560 calories. And if I eat this whole thing, I get 770 calories. But I don't necessarily eat this whole thing, but half of it is not enough, you know what I mean? So I'm going to try this out. Me and Charlie are eating some of these tonight. Hey, do you want to try that pizza we got at Kroger last night? Yes. The smart crust. Which one do you want? I want bacon. What do you want? Bacon. Now, on the side, it's got instructions for microwave and also has for oven. And I think oven tastes better. 400 degrees for 15 minutes. And I got a cheap oven, so it'll probably take 20 minutes. And also, we're doing both at the same time, so it's going to take even longer. Good. Yeah, you think it'll take longer because it's more mass? Yeah, that's usually how heat works. Because science. Urban. Do it. Set the timer to 20. I did it. Get the hot pads on my hands. These aren't hot pads. <laughs> Bottom or top? Bottom one. Ah, get in there. I did it. Now time to start the timer. Look what just came in the mail. And it wasn't supposed to be here yet. It got here early from Amazon. Yeah. It's something I've been saving up money to buy for this dude. So much tape. Too much tape. It tapes all the sides. Bubble toss. Paper toss. Do not toss. Yeah. yeah toss. We don't that. The laptop itself, which is in blue, it's made of plastic, but it feels pretty premium. Yeah. Toss. Oh, I'm so jealous right now, actually. Yeah, it's so nice. And you can turn off the spine. The funny thing is, people are all concerned about trying to cover up their webcam because they're being spied on. Yeah. Dude. If a hacker is in your computer and he could see you through your webcam, what's he gonna see? You sitting there going. No, he can see everything. He can see what you're typing, what your passwords are. Yeah. Who cares about the webcam? Yeah, exactly. Just if you're really scared about your webcam, just put some clothes on when you're at your laptop. Focus. If you want to see more about this laptop, get subscribed because Charlie and I are going to be going over this laptop here soon. So I don't let die again. Yeah, rebooting the universe just to have my son back. It takes a lot of energy. Oh, it's so steamy. Sizzly. Looks so crispy. Just looks like I could gobble it up in a second. It's so appetizing. Now we get to try this deliciousness. Mm. Oh, slice is really easy. Do we bake it enough? Oh, yeah. Goldeny fresh. This looks like some delicious pan pizza, or whatever it's called. Something like that. Is that trademarked by Domino's? Am I going to get sued now? <laughs> no. This looks absolutely delicious. All right. Tell me if it's any good. Mm. I can definitely taste the chicken crust. Really? Kind of. All right, my turn. I like it though. Dang! Got a blue cheese on it. Mmm. I actually like it without the blue cheese. Me too. I think this is better just without. I give it a, one, a 10 out of 10. What do you say? Yeah, 10 out of 10.
All right, peeps. There's food on my thumb. All right, peeps. Thumbs up. I licked my thumb. It's wet. It's gross. Mm. You gotta try this. It's really good. Okay, bye. Mm. Toss. Hey, time travelers. Hello, humans. Wasn't that pizza good? Yeah, it was really, really good. I actually was eating them on nights where I'm working on my mining computer and it's driving me nuts. And I just had a pizza and some broccoli with some blue cheese on the broccoli and it got me through it. And I, my weight loss was staying on track for my plans for the week. So that was great. And I felt full and satisfied. And I got Charlie a laptop finally. Check out this gorgeous B-roll of the laptop. It's a Lenovo, what is it? IdeaPad 3, 15.6 inch with the Ryzen 5 3500U. Yeah, that's the CPU. And I'll have a link in the description if you guys wanna check it out. And we're actually doing a few videos, some on his channel where we did configurations on it, and a, at least one video on my channel where I opened it up to see what upgrade potential it has. So. Make sure you check out his channel when those come out and subscribe to both our channels. The thing was, I was shopping for it and I pretty, was pretty sure what model I was gonna get him and I showed it to him and he went and found the better one that had a full-size keyboard and a wider screen. So I ended up getting that one when the price dropped on Amazon. I was like, snipe! <laughs> and now, to community news. This comment comes from Justin Greenidge. He was talking to me about my broccoli and chicklin only for a week video. He said, you're Pronouncing struggles 101. What do you mean pronouncing struggles 101? He says, you're hungry because you need to eat, add fats to the diet like coconut oil or almond nuts. Well, he's absolutely correct because I've been on keto for years and the trick is you eat fat and your body metabolizes it better than carbs and it keeps you in ketosis so your weight loss stays steady and all that the thing was i was trying an extreme diet for a week to see what would happen extreme extreme and i actually lost 10 pounds not in that whole week but oh it like got me going and i ate mostly chicken and carbs with fat after that so he's right you know, but I kickstarted it with a week of just chicken and broccoli. So that's really what happened. Yeah, that makes sense. This next comment comes from someone with a really, really cool name. His name is The. A random person that I've seen a lot before. What, on your channel? Yeah. He just says, I know nothing about tech, but I still watch this, lol. And he is commenting on my temporary motherboard because reasons video. That's a lot of people do that. They find it entertaining to see other people work on things. Wait, it's actually called temporary motherboard because reasons. I watched it, but I didn't. You didn't I, notice the title? Yeah, I didn't. <laughs> and this third comment comes from Finn on my video about having computer problems and trying to overclock my video card while mining for Ethereum and it going and bugging out. He says, your overclock is too high. Um, well, I looked back at my video and I realized it was too blurry so people couldn't see my overclocks. Derp. So if you look at my overclock file thingy, what's it? This is a email draft I, I keep so I can have it wherever I am, whichever computer I'm on, I just look at my phone. And if we scroll down to where I got the 1080, it's right here. Now these numbers, the 9100, 600, that's what I use when I use MSI Afterburner. 75, 100, 650, I was able to get it stable with the actual mining software itself, which is lower watts and higher hash rate as a result. But that's the power limit, 90% versus 75%. Core clock is plus 100 megahertz and memory clock is plus 600 or 650 megahertz. You guys can Google that and compare it. Um, it's probably not as good as what you can Google because it's a little harder to mine Ethereum than it was back in the day when people figured out these overclocks and it gets harder every few weeks or something like that. And now, dad joke time. This dad joke comes from my dad, actually. He sends me a lot of these. This time he's just texting me. He says, how many beans do the Irish put in their bean soup? And I'm like, I don't know how many. And he says, 239 only. One more would make it too farty. The emoticon you sent. And the emoticon I sent is like, this is just like, face like that. Yeah, it's just like, 
Why? It's so bad. There's an even more worser dad joke. Bonus dad joke. Do you know what breed of dogs leprechauns like best? What's that I said? Golden retrievers. Get it? Get it? Get it? <laughs> and this week's Enjoy This Random Thing comes from Charlie. He found it where? On Reddit or somewhere? No, Strange Park streamed about it, like a part of his stream. Oh, really? Yes. I, I love that channel, yeah. Strange Parts. I, I looked at this thing, I'm like, what is this? Rick Flash version 1.0, the SSD that Rick rolls you, not a real SSD? Look at it, it says 970 Cheapo Plus, Rectified Tech Electronics, 960 terabytes, like I wish. <laughs> but I'm looking through the pictures, it I'm like- It has a tiny speaker in it. And I looked at it, I'm like, this is an actual circuit board. What the heck is it, right? And I scrolled down. If you read this, and I'll link it in the description if you want to check it out. It's a fake SSD you put in a computer, and I guess you can make it Rickroll people by playing the song from Rick Astley? That's just nonsense. Yeah. It also displays a GIF on your mobile phone if you connect to it. Oh, because it's what? It's a Wi-Fi thing? Yeah. It actually transmits Wi-Fi? It also displays a GIF of Rick Astley in a captive portal when you connect to the free Wi-Fi. Well, that's it for this week's video. If you've tried the uh, Smart Crust Pizza, tell us in the comments what you thought about it. If you haven't tried it, I totally recommend it. You go to the website that I've linked in the description and it has a way where you can search which stores around you sell it. That's what we did, right? Yeah. But remember, it's like a, a small one, the like personal size pizzas, you gotta find it in the smaller pizzas in the frozen aisle. That's it for this week's video. Thanks for watching. Here's some other videos for you to watch and you should subscribe to my channel over here and you can at me over here, actually the other way around. What am I thinking? Well, you know, whatever. You broke windows. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.